All right, this is for a grease line replacement. Right here is the grease trap. Right there is the first break. Uh, it's in one foot two inches deep. It comes this way. You can follow this cut. It goes into here. That's where the PVC ends. Now this pipe this way is belly. It goes this way. It looks okay. Right there is a connection between the PVC and the cast iron. The cast iron is rotted out in the bottom. Now from there, the cast iron is rotted out all the way back underneath to about right where he's standing. Uh, and then this pipe has got cracks in it all the way back. And it comes back this way. It shoots all the way back that way and comes over. There's a clean out. All right. There. So you're talking about 40 feet of concrete. Uh, end up being a night job, I'm sure. There's nobody occupying this building, so we could get all the way to here, all the way through this in the first night, and then we'd have to do mows the second night, and then the rest of it's all outside, uh, and so Charlie's just not affected. But we do need to redo it to there. If we have to get into the tank, then we have to pump the tank and redo the baffle, or at least redo the line right to it, because there's a it's got an internal baffle, so we could redo the line right to it. That would be fun. Anyway, so that's what we've got all the way down that hallway. We got a nice area to haul everything out, but it's still tight.